Mount Evans could soon be getting a new name, Mount Blue Sky. The name comes from the Arapaho tribe known as the Blue Sky People. Today, Governor Polis did weigh in, telling the federal government's naming board he too supports this change. The board is nearly certain to back the change, given the support of the state and a consortium of tribes that pushed for it. Alan Janae has the latest tonight from Jefferson County. The governor's weighing in on this is the last piece as the state forward its idea for this name change to the Federal Board of Geographic Names. The Cheyenne and Arapaho people had pushed for the change to leave off the name of John Evans so closely associated with the Sand Creek Massacre where they suffered greatly. In nearby Evergreen, where a Friday night gets busy at Cactus Jack's, people were pouring their thoughts out after hearing about the change. I support it, considering that that is their land, that we should wish to respect it. There's also, like, no reason to. It's so dumb. Like, it's a name. If they change the name, I think we're going to make the mistake and probably call it Mount Evans, and, and, uh, like we do with uh, the Pepsi Center. But officially, the mountain that towers over the middle part of the Front Range will likely be known for a different part of its past. The governor says he signed off because it had a lot of support. What speaks to me is the ground up process that really brought this forward to the state. From the community, from the Clear Creek County commissioners, yes, also from the tribes who have historical links to the lands. Even some of Evans' descendants. To the Cheyenne and Arapaho tribe, says Southern Tribe Governor Reggie Wassini, it never belonged. We glorified the massacre by putting a name on a national landmark in the state of Colorado. That isn't right. The governor believes the same. The reason this name is so offensive is, again, his actions empowered the slaughter of innocent Native Americans. So this is not the war with, with Native Americans. These are women and children, well documented. To the tribes, it is time to move on from Evans and live under a blue sky. Ten years from now, you, people are going to look and say, well, what did it used to be called? You know, as generations pass, things are forgotten. There's already discussion here about putting up plaques or educational displays that would tell people why the name has been changed from Evans to Mount Blue Sky. First, though, it does have to get through the U.S. Board of Geographic Names, which will pick it up and could vote on it as soon as next Thursday. The change coming not long after that. In Jefferson County, I'm Alan Janae covering Colorado First.